This playthrough is rated M for Mature. It's time for Aya to be liberated from Eve and vice versa. Greetings and salutations, viewers of all our back here with another episode of Parasite Eve. In the last episode, we finished Day 5, which we thought we had taken out Eva, and, well, I guess I think we did. Day 6 must be the rest of the game, and we're going to watch the credit roll and talk to everyone out. That's got to be the reason why, but yeah... Uh, Eve liquefied after releasing your goo monster, and we shot a nuke at her, even though it actually wasn't a nuke, it was just a big, big old bomb. But, you know, just, you know, tip for tat and all that other. Or tomato, tomato, that's what I meant to say. Something like that. So, all right, well, let's head into day six liberation and let's see what we find out. Oh, I also, I've heard that in the Japanese version, day five and day six's names are slightly, are switched. Um, I guess that makes sense in that case. I don't know, but anyway. But now we don't need to save. Hmm. I guess they're just checking to make sure that Eve's too, truly dead. Hey, come on! I guess A is just kind of taking it all in. Hey, what's wrong? Or, oh yeah, whatever. Hey guys, see me take on that lady? Ha, you were great, Aya. Shows that only my partner can pull it off, eh? Yes, Aya, I'm relieved that you made it back safely. Why the hell did Eve have to bring all this to Statue of Liberty? Oh yeah, and she knocked it over too, so uh, that's gonna be a problem. Uh, because of the ocean and what it symbolizes. What does it symbolize? The sea is the mother of all creation. This is where she wanted to give birth. Oh, that makes sense, I guess. Symbolism. Oh, like the little music ditty they've got there. Let's talk to Daniel. If you don't mind, I'd like to have some time for myself. I guess for the reliving of Lorraine's death again? I mean, he already did that when she got turned into a pile of goo, but all right. And for a guy like who was estranged for his wife because they were ex, you know, ex-wife, and he got custody of the kid. He seemed to really care about her, but then again, he was married to her for however many years. Obviously, you know, with his kid Ben, who I don't even know how old he is, like seven or something like that. But anyway, everyone else has been got inside, Miss. I guess we're getting ready to leave. So, all right, let's go through the door here and talk to who, who's ever actually here. <laughs> Man, I have trouble opening up one of those doors, huh? You could tell she was really pulling on it. No need for this anymore. You take it. Keep it as a souvenir, huh? Y yes, thank you. Oh, I didn't know Wayne was here. Huh. Hey, Maida. Oh, yeah. Wayne came all the way from the precinct to see you. Yo, yo, I, uh. Um, I'll be outside. The smell of oil makes me, um, rather queasy. Nerd! I knew it. I knew you could do it. When I heard that you blew that thing to bits, I had to come over here. Everyone's saying that you're the number one cop in New York right now. Who, if we'd shot Eve earlier, may have not even had this all come to pass in the first place. Thanks, Aya, for being the number one cop. No. Hey, what's wrong? You killed that thing. Aren't you happy? I guess you're in shock or something, huh? Yeah, you're probably tired, too. I'll take the things that you're in your way, so you rest up now, you hear? Okay. I don't think I need to really put anything in the inventory, do I? No, I think I've got everything that I want. Uh, actually, <clears throat> I don't know if I'll need these. I might take a couple of uh, medicine threes and put them in the inventory just in case. You know, for, because we've only, well, actually, we're going to get some extra stuff here in a second, so, yeah. Hey, as a souvenir for blowing a Eve away, I'll engrave your name in any weapon. Choose a weapon and armor. Yep, this is the this is the stuff we get to take over to uh, um, an extra mode or whatever you want to call it. So let's take uh, the P5 PDW and change the name of it. So let's uh, um, let's BS <laughs> and backspace it. Um, let's see. Nah, I can't get that. I was trying to look at. I was trying to think of like. Uh, no. Um, let's. I could do that, I guess. Uh, yeah, we'll you know we'll do something. Uh, we'll do something more western. So now yeah, we're gonna just name it the longsword. Wait, no, I can't name it longsword, can I? Hmm. 
I was trying to think of a, like famous fancy names to call it. Like I guess I could call it Masamune because that would fit, but that's more of a Eastern style, which I guess is a more it's Eastern style game. Um, or I mean, it's not a big deal. Let's see, can I call it? Clay Ooh, call it Claymore. That would that would fit. Yeah, let's call it Claymore. Why not? All right, we'll call it Claymore, and then the jacket we'll call it. Um, uh, let me think. I was gonna call it chainmail or something like that, or maybe breastplate. Um, let's see, can I fit this in there? Yeah, we'll call it the armor of Deimos. Why not? It's great being on this cruiser, eh? Gotta tell my mom about this. Well, thanks for that. Uh, yeah, and I think they're changing our yep, changed our inventory, the two items. So, all right. Anything else to say, Wayne? So you gonna hand me your excess baggage or what? Nope, nope, I don't need to. All right, thanks, Wayne. Oh yeah, there's a little thing about the Navy cruiser. I wonder if that'll be important. Nah, probably not. Oh, we could save here, but the game's over, right? Why do I need to? Why do I need to worry about that? What's up, this guy? Well done. I have received some supplies from Ab Williams. Please make use of whatever items you need. But we're at the end of the game. Anyway, you can ask for your ammo, cure C, cure D, cure M, cure. Your P, Medicine 3, Medicine 4. We're going to take some Medicine 4s, though. Yeah, give us a couple of those. Let's see if he can, if we have a few more. Sorry, but I don't have any more. Okay. Um, actually, how's my inventory? You know, we could take some Medicine 3s. Why not? Like I said, I might not need it, but you never know. So we'll take a couple of those. Well, he gives us, wow, he gives us four of those. Holy crap. Okay. Well, uh, I guess let's go back outside and just see the end of the game, right? I mean, clearly the game's over. Jeez, looks like Aya's gonna like almost rip her arms out trying to try to open the dang door. Man, well, this is it. Some Christmas, huh? Yeah, I beat this game a little too. Oh, it's going on Magma, by the way. Tell me about it. Hmm? What's going on? Sounds like a helicopter or something. Yeah, I beat this game a little faster than I expected. I guess I could have spaced it out a little better, but... Sorry, we're late. We cannot approach the creature without absolute confirmation of its death. Okay, now it's not going on automatically. Your help was greatly appreciated. Please rest inside. Forever. As citizens of the United States! Question mark, exclamation point. What's going on? That was automatic. What? What is it? You scanned me! That huge creature that was the mitochondria was creating was creating was Oh no. She's not dead, is she? It couldn't have been the uterus for the ultimate being. No. Oh, well so Eve is dead, it's just the ultimate being did survive. So the final boss of the game is a baby. Great. <laughs> uh, there's some words and some phrases I could use for this, uh, but we're not going to say those. What the hell is that? You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, exactly, lady. Uh, that's the ultimate being. We didn't make it in time. Oh, what are those explosions? Or what are these explosions? The mitochondria energy must be out of control to the point where it's causing those explosions. Or it's a Looney Tunes cartoon, one of the two. We'll escape by helicopter. Please follow me. Guess all we can do now is run. Yeah, we got to, because you guys will com combust still. Aya, come on. Aya, what's wrong? I, I have to take care of this. Well, yeah, I guess. Got to finish it to the conclusion. You know, Eve's baby. You know, we killed Eve, so we got to finish the baby. So we're going to be performing a, you know, emergency procedure, if you know what I mean. I, uh, I, uh, no. Don't worry about me. I'll be back. Please hurry. Shut up, man. <laughs> I, uh, please take. Cut out with that voodoo stuff already. We can't be wasting time. 
No, Daniel, please, it's different. It's not the voodoo stuff. <laughs> I'm surprised they even called it voodoo stuff, so. Yeah, I was just shoving him around. Please, hurry, hurry, please. You two should go now. Aya, you come back no matter what you hear. Yeah, stop with that voodoo stuff, uh, Meta. No one wants your voodoo stuff clumping out of our inventory. How dare you. Oh, there they go. All right, time to fight a baby. It's trying to be intimidating, but so cute. Let's murder it. It's you or me. Who's going to be the one to make it through? Yeah, when I got here the first time I played this game, uh, that's the question. When I first got here the first time I played, yeah, I didn't have the best weapons for this, so I was basically unprepared and, uh, yeah, to basically replay the game from, well, not from scratch, but actually, maybe I did, because I don't think I, like, even though I save every file, I think I wasn't prepared to, like, for this part, so I had to, like, basically replay the game to, to finally beat it after all these years, but, and we want to make sure not to stay too close to him, because he can do... Yeah, you can do, like, a burst attack on you, so you have to be kind of careful. <laughs> I don't know why something funny about just, like, blasting a child and making that noise. Bat, 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 bat. Oh, God. Dang it. I probably could have used Barry at that point. Oh, well. But I wanted to have kind of full PE by this point. All right, we murdered a baby. Yes. We are the hero, right? I mean, this is the ultimate being destroying everyone, so I guess we... Whoa. Nuts. What is, is is it growing? What's happening? That's what I want to know, I, Aya. Anyway, for part two of this, and I want to start this out with a bang. I want to show off the uh, liberate ability. It's basically Omni Slash for Parasite Eve. It's glorious. Oh yeah, I guess I'll just I'll press Square to not use a turn so, or use my other action. So yeah, she turns into like some. Well, she turns into kind of Eve, just a different version of Eve when she had the wings as well. Yeah, look at all that damage we're doing. Yeah, on me slash indeed. <laughs> Inspirations from Final Fantasy VII are strong in this game. Yeah, look at all that damage we did there. Yeah, it's, be it's great against bosses, especially the final boss of the game. So it does use all your PE when you do it, though. So. Oh, I oh we just what the? Did we completely destroy the boss with Liberate? Holy crap! I didn't expect it to actually finish him off. Or her, or it off. I didn't expect to do that much damage. What you're supposed to do is it's supposed to split up in two parts, like the head and the body. But somehow I did enough damage to both parts during it, because I think it hit both sections evenly enough to completely destroy it. But yeah, it's not done yet. So now we got phase three of the final boss. This, this is the mature being. All right, so now we have to fight a mature man. Well, at least it's more... All right, I think he's also got multiple. Oh, he's also got multiple. I think he, oh, maybe it's just, just the one form. Yeah, I'm trying to wait for my, uh, uh, oh, wait, we have to get closer to him. No, ow. Yeah, I, I, I kind of messed up there. You're supposed to get closer to him when he does that ability. I probably should heal myself, actually. Oh, well, well there goes another med medicine for it. Uh, oh, nope, gotta get closer. Well, what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to run towards him when that attack goes on. So, like, to try and reduce the damage. Although, I'm not doing a very good job at that. We're almost done with all the damage. We're done now. Ah! <laughs> there goes another one, so. Alright, let's uh, liberate again. Do, like, a ton of damage then. <clears throat> All right, take this, Omni Slash. Yeah, I guess I just must have gotten really lucky with all the damage to him because usually, usually he has just a little bit of HP to where I have to manually shoot him in the second form. So I was, I was generally surprised when I, I he blew up. I was like, oh, hmm. we used up ended up using like a couple of medicine fours. So there we go.
Haha, ha, gotcha. Gotcha, ultimate being. Apparently a lady with a gun is stronger than you are. That's sad. Especially a lady who didn't want to do her job for like... Okay, she did do her job, but... Aw, come on, man. Another form? This is a JRPG, isn't it? It's still growing. No, wait, is it evolving? I don't think that's how evolution works. It's meta... Okay, technically... Okay, that's a pet peeve of mine. When games say like people are changing, they're evolving, they're technically metamorphosizing because they're not evolving. Because evolving is the process of over, you know, centuries, thousands of years that a group of people, or a, group, a creature or a group of creatures eventually form dominant, like, um, uh, not strategies, uh, dominant, like, traits and stuff like that over the years to, to blend in with their environment. He's metamorphosizing. That's what that is. I'm sorry. Anyway. So anyway, this part is a joke boss fight. There's a we just kind of blast him and that's it. Yeah, we can't do like any damage to him at all, or it, because I have no idea what it is. But yeah, it's a yeah, just blast a couple times. So yeah, we're not doing any damage. I know you want to continue living. After all, you were just born, but I want to live too, like all other human beings. And yeah, this ultimate being is just blowing things up. So. It's kind of a miscommunication. If we just sat it down, gave it some herbal tea, some Earl Grey, uh, I bet we could work out our problems. But uh, no, that ain't happening. We gotta blast it with a gun. Damn, there's no end to this. If only we could get this to Aya. What are those? They're bullets with Aya cells in them. So that's what you were trying to give her. But I think it's too late now. There's nothing we can do. Nothing we can do. I guess we are too far away. If we get too close, we'll catch on fire. Stupid! Give it to me! What are you going to do, Daniel? What the? Huh, the son of a bitch did it. What a, a good plan. Throw the uh, thing and then jump into the water, so. Daniel, this is from Meta? I guess, I, I assume originally there was supposed to be like subtitles or maybe something, or maybe she just assumed it's from Meta because there's no dialogue exchange, so, but uh, yeah, Daniel did it. He gave us the bullets, so now we can fight this thing at max power. And I think we automatically get uh, equipped with Meta's gun. Yeah, because we need it to use it. That's why we have it. It's for this this fight so and we do max damage 999 baby ha huh. and yeah we're like gonna take very little damage even at your even if you have not very good armor you still don't take that much damage I mean it hurts I feel pain but yeah take this haha -ha, my cells are beating you now just sit down and die will you It's dead, right? Please be dead. Daniel. Uh-oh. It's not quite dead. Will we be able to finally finish it off? Is Eve's plan going to come to fruition? Will we escape this creature? Oh, my God. There's got to be something on the cruise to get rid of this. Well, I hope there is. But find out next time in the finale of Parasite Eve. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Oh, God, it's coming right for us. Get out of there.